Okay, so I'm going to show you how to use the HP Smart app um, to scan multiple documents into a single PDF. We're just going to go ahead and click on the icon. It's going to open up. We're going to scroll down to where it says camera scan. And then we're going to get the document that we want to um, add in. Okay, we are going to get it in the right window. Okay, um, once we've got it in that window, we're going to get a screen that looks like this, where it's trying to decide what we want um, to put in. I didn't take a very good picture because I'm doing this with one hand. I'm just going to say OK. <clears throat> now, to add another document, what we're going to do is we're going to press the big plus button down here. OK, and it's going to give us a chance to take another picture. So we're going to go ahead and I'm just going to use the same document again because it's not really important for this. So you can see what we're trying to do. Okay. So um, once I've got that picture, I'll go ahead and click next. Okay, and I can keep doing this until I've got all of the pages that I want to add. If I want to add another page, I hit the plus button. If I'm finished with all of the pages that I need to add, then I go ahead and at the bottom, you see where it says um, share and save. We're going to go ahead and click the share and save button. And it's going to open this page. On this page, what I need you to do is I need you to, under file name, um, you're going to go ahead and type a name for your file in here. I would like it to um, be your name. I'm just going to put my initials for the sake of time. And then the other thing you need to do is you need to make sure here where it says format that it says PDF. I don't think PDF is the default. I think mine's on PDF because I've already made one. So you just want to make sure that you click that you want to do a PDF. It'll put a little green check mark beside it. Then you can go ahead and go back. Once it looks like this where it's got um, a file name it has the format as PDF, file size is actual, you're ready to go ahead and save it. Okay, and so now it's going to open up. Um, where do we want to save it? Um, you can save it to files if you want to, if you know how to um, get to there on your phone and do all that, that's fine. Um, I'm just going to save mine to the file folder that says save to HP Smart. That way I know exactly where they are. Um, now that it's saved, I can go ahead and exit out of this app. And I'm going to go over to the Teams app. So I'm going to go into Teams. I'm going to go to Assignments. I'm going to choose an assignment for a class that I'm a student in. So I'm just going to pick High School Dance because I'm a student in that class. Okay, I'm going to pick a random assignment just to show you how to do this. We're going to click on Add Work. It's going to ask us to attach a resource. We're going to choose Upload from this device. And we are going to choose to Browse. Okay. Normally what comes up is that you are going to get, um, when you click Browse, you're going to get something like this. It has a list of all the folders that you have things saved in. Okay. So what you're looking for is the folder where you saved your stuff. And in my case, it's called HP Smart. So I'm going to click that folder. Once you've used HP Smart once, it's going to assume that that's where you want to go. And it's going to take you right to this screen every time. And all your files are going to be listed here. Okay. So all I have to do is click the file. I only have one file in there because I deleted my other ones. And now it's loading. Okay and then you would hit the turn in button okay i don't have a turn in button i have a turn in late because this assignment was due a long time ago i don't want to confuse Ms. ostricker so i'm not going to click it 
and that's it. Once you click the turn in button, it comes to me as part of your assignment, a single PDF with as many pages attached to it as you want. Please let me know if you have any questions.